Hey, peace, everybody. Actually, I've been um, I was a part of a discussion, and it was somebody asked me a question about what was my thoughts about, I guess, uh, cheating in relationships, or, or I know it wasn't about cheating, but why, you know, men and women cheat or whatever. But of course, specifically, they're kind of asking about men. But um, so I just want to share my little take real fast. I'm going to keep it real simple. I mean, of course, there's many, many different reasons. But I want to bring up one reason that I think that we often overlook. And that one reason is uh, the quest for peace. I think a lot of us have forgotten that um, sex, uh, from a spiritual, energetic aspect, represents that peaceful exchange. All right. So I want you to hold that in mind. But I also want you to think about that in relationships nowadays, um, sadly, that we are not operating from an intention. And notice I said intention. An intention to seeking the peace from each other. A lot of us are bringing a lot of chaos to each other. A lot of us are bringing a lot of stress and irritation. And so when we find ourselves doing that, what we are bankrupt of, we're going to seek it. And so in a lot of cases, um, the cheating that we call cheating that's occurring, in a lot of cases, it's just for that individual is trying to find a sense of peace or some sense of solace outside of their arrangement or agreement uh, with their partner or partners that, you know, that they're entertaining. And so in the day is they're going to seek out for that peace. Peace is, uh, we forget, peace is a soul need, um, even though we don't function like that. But I think it gets to a, a point um, where that becomes very important. So people begin to move in that direction and go seek it out. And so that's what we see nowadays. And so a lot of times, again, you know, people are having, uh, engaging in, and trying to find a solace with somebody else. If somebody else represents peace to them, they're going to seek it out. They're probably going to entertain it. You know, it's just a matter of time. And so we either can be honest with ourselves and be like, okay, am I bringing peace to somebody? Am I bringing irritation? I mean, if I'm bringing all this extra to them, then go ahead and expect for them to go ahead and seek the peace that they need. You know, all of us needs a moment to decompress. We always need a moment to take time out to ourselves. So the same thing, you know, somebody's going to use the outlet of sex to kind of hit that. So I just want to come with a different angle, different twist, but hey, I just want to drop down a little something. I had a couple people ask me about this part of the discussion. I said, I figured I'd go ahead and share that and see what y'all think. Hey, one love. Touch back down with y'all. It'll be easy.